Hey guys, and welcome back to Pneumonia. This is the Holy Slit, and I am Stejo. Last episode, we lost um, quite a few fucking gnomes in this massacre out here. We lost uh, Rick Wienberg and Blaine III and Herr Weaver Schmerz. And Psycho. Holy fuck, we lost a lot of people. Wait, did we lose Rick? Yeah. Oh, for fuck's sake. I can't even remember what they all done. God. Good God, man! Um, just shows that we really need to get this done and stop sending people outside, basically. God damn it! That was so annoying. So freaking annoying. Yeah, hello. Oh I should probably tell my uh, my militia to actively avoid confrontation. Uh, formations, the militia should probably avoid enemies to stop that happening again. What a fucking nightmare, honestly. Quite gutted about that. Ugh. Ah well. Um, first day of spring we'll get a fucking shit ton of gnomes though. So at the end of this episode, I forgot to do it at the end of the last episode, I'm going to add all of their names to my wee list so that I've got... So that I know who needs to be added in again when we get the new guys. Also, if you want your name in the game, please drop a little comment and I'll make sure that you get added to the list as well. I've already got a load of people on the list already, so... Just whenever. So that's all of the birches now gone and people will start collecting it all. Cool beans. Still a bit gutted about that. Honestly, can't believe it. We lost so many men there. I thought they were a bit, a bit better than that, but obviously not. We've actually lost twelve people. Out of Fifteen. Who the fuck's idle? Ah, they're probably going to get food or something. It says idle when they're not really. They're idle when they're dancing about in the great hall. I hope no dares lost a foot or anything in that engagement. A couple of people lost their lives, but I hope nobody lost like a limb or something and survived. We've already got Grownie who I need to like babysit by letting him sit on the fucking Tinkerer's shot. The sun has set yet again. Just watch us get fucking invaded again and any of the people out here to collect stuff die. Why the hell is there? I don't know. Maybe there's a rare currency you can get saplings from just chopping stuff down. I really couldn't care less about the saplings, I just want the logs. Just someone just bring them in. Nope, <laughs> poor Growny passed out of exhaustion. Was he nearly in bed? Where is he? That doesn't actually tell you on that. That's odd. I need to actually be able to grab him. Wait a minute. Yeah. Bowden Prime. Why are you in a Bowden shirt? What the hell? You know, Commander of Ponage. I know it says it should be in a breastplate. Fucking didn't realise that I needed to select this for him. Ah, I selected it for these guys. Go put on the fucking copper. God. Unless it broke. It may have broke. As a as an actual possibility. Oh, that's a shame. Um I'm not gonna tell him to fill in the rest of the stuff in these rooms, like the rest of the birch stuff, until these are made. Because Jesus Christ, is it taking forever to make these? And as soon as they are made, we can start decking these guys out. It's getting quite annoying now. Um, I just want to clean that stuff up. There we go. 
Sat Crowney there with his little missing foot. That's a shame. It's alright though, eventually, hopefully, we'll start getting mechanical feet and stuff. Ah, only two left. Strange Dragon's in on this, is less than three. It's weird. And it's already made one, so I don't know what that's all about. Fuck man, that's five dead gnomes. Rick, Herb, Psycho, Arn oh, Arnob as well. Jesus Christ. Who did we actually lose there? We definitely lost a blacksmith. Um, don't lose any miners. Oh, I think we actually lost a woodcutter as well. Shit. I think it was a woodsmith that we lost. Uh, Taylor. We lost another stone mate. Oh no, that was Crowney. I think we had another rancher as well. Jeweler obviously is fucking dimpy still there. Oh, we lost another farmer. Oh, we did lose a lot of people there. I want at least two people in each position. Oh, there we go. Someone has got a bit of intelligence. You dick. <laughs> you fucking dick. I'm sitting saying he's got intelligence. Uh, nope, needs to go and get me some wine. What an asshole. What an asshole. Oh, Honey Badger's died, I don't know how. Actually. <laughs> hmm, I wonder how the honey badger died. Yeah. Shh, don't go outside, gentlemen. Um, excuse me? You're dead. Who are you? Because you're an idiot. God damn it, dimp. Yeah, good job. Good job, buddy. <laughs> oh, he's running them back. Oh god, this is going to be the end, isn't it? I can't really do anything. All I can really do is just fast forward and hope that they don't all die. Oh, Golan's bled to death. Got bled to death? Nobody could actually kill him. He just bled to death. Wow, the way that that worked there was pretty good. He kind of got ganked one by one. Another golem died. And I reckon this golem's gonna die. Yeah, there we go. Perfect, so that actually didn't go quite as bad as it could have. <laughs> the fact that Dimp kind of made them go on a merry little jaunt away was pretty good. Who are you? Because you you've lost an arm. Mr. Bartowski. Yes, missing his right arm. Her right arm. Mr. Her. Motherfucker, man. I had to stop letting my uh, my regular gnomes get ganked like that. <laughs> Just missing arms and legs and all sorts. I says, I really need this to get done. At least my fucking military gnomes aren't missing anything. Who's this? His little groany is like. I've got my sausage, I'm going to go to the Great Hall and have something to eat, have my lunch and it'll get just before that and it'll pass out from exhaustion. I don't think he's making that much progress because he's like constantly dead. It's a shame, obviously that's not a great distance that he has to travel to actually go to work. But meh. What can you do, apart from fix it? I mean, I'd have to reset absolutely everything. Oh, my phone. Ah, oh, my phone's ringing. I will answer that once the episode's finished. Man, that thing vibrates loud. I can hear that through my noise cancelling headphones. I wonder if you guys can hear it. I wonder if it gets picked up. That'd be weird. Look at all these dead bodies. Ugh. I think it's kind of sick that the gnomes sit outside a butcher shop. Obviously they don't get butchered, but 
Still kinda sick. Uh, so is this going? There must be only two beds left to get made. Uh, loads of applewood stuff's been needing to get made. Since we're on our applewood, the better. If you ask me, I should have really left that instead of clear cutting that applewood outside. Um, I should have really just left it so that the the guys ran out of applewood and fixated on finishing all the birch stuff. But I was like, oh, if I do this, then things will get done quicker. Yeah. And um, what I can do right now, though, is I can place the bauxite statues. Bauxite is actually used in the making of uh, aluminium, if I'm not mistaken. I was trying to think the other day. I was like, "What's what is uh, bauxite used?" I'm just getting another fucking phone call. Maybe I'll keep this on my lap so I can just mute it whenever. Um, but yeah, it's actually used in the creation of aluminium. Quite interesting. These should get made in no time. I mean, I think it's Stijo that does the uh, the crafting. He's fucking quick. I was like, what are they doing? But they're just moving the stuff over. I wonder why it gets put into that one before it gets put into this one. Or whatever it is. Yeah, yeah don't get it. Well, whatever. Oh. Uh, one more. There you go. That's it done. And then he'll just fill up the rest of these chests full of uh, slabs. As he's want to do. Um, too much four poster bed frames there, and nobody making mattresses, which is just odd. As I, 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 I suppose I don't really mind as long as I'm making bandages, which they are not. Why are they not making bandages? Who's my tailor? Spastica? You just got an injured right eye, bro. Um. Population. Stock. Why are you stocking items? Oh god, have we actually run out of cotton? We have. That's dire. That is actually dire. I'm actually going to have to get people out here foraging this cotton. Oh god. Ah, oh, there we go, that's like a lot of cotton out there. Jesus Christ. It's happened again. <laughs> uh, that could have been really, really dodgy. Luckily we'll get some cotton and we'll be able to get our bandage reserves back up. It's only because we made so many um, so many beds that we ran out of cotton so quickly. Yeah, it's a bear. Great. Oh no, it's a bear! We've got one more day to last until it's uh, spring again. And then that'll be awesome. And then we'll get to rename everyone. But that'll probably be at the start of next episode actually. Do 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 Is that oh no that's pine, that's fine. Uh that's apple logs. So take it we've run out of apple now then. Yes we have. And now he's just making pine planks. Why? Because he can. We've got loads of birch, so why is he not making the birch for the... Oh! Why is that not set to craft ingredients?
Wait, it is, it does accept generate jobs. I need two lots of butch bellows, don't I? Yeah, I do. Butch bellows and another phone call. And butch bellows, yes. So why the hell are you not making me any butch bellows? Hmm, sir? Hmm? Uh, bellows make me butch ones. Now, bitch. Yeah, he's in it now. Thank fuck. I don't, I don't understand that. I just don't get it. Supposed to accept generated jobs, but just didn't. There we go. I've got a load of uh, a load of cotton kicking about now. Let's see. Yes, we've got one set of butch bellows. What do these need now? A copper anvil and a bauxite hearth. Is people just not making any of this shit now? Is that what we've got to? But I need to actually. Fucking hell. I had two bauxite hearths as far as I know. There's one with the bauxite hearth and. bauxite hearth and two copper anvils. So let's just fucking do this ourselves then, why don't we? Huh? How about that? Metalworker, nope. Forge. Fucking two copper anvil. I thought we had to like more of something else, but it wasn't it just any bar? Two more copper an anvils. There you go. You've got stuff to do. I fucking make them so that these things can get built. Jesus Christ. I think it was because like oh, I don't know. Did I do it when it was paused or something? It just didn't like that. It just didn't generate the jobs properly. Um, we'll stick around until these are built anyway, because that's the, the hearths are getting made and hopefully soon someone will be able to make the anvil. Where's our... Where are you? We... Blacksmith. Ah, no name nom number one. No name nom number one! Let's go to bed. Great. Just fantastic. Oh well, what we'll do just now then is we will sort the the doors and stuff. So everything's ready for these bedrooms. Obviously we're never gonna need this many bedrooms because we lost like most of our guys. Um that's not a dress, that's a cabinet. God damn it. Furniture cabinet merch cabinet. And we'll fire them there, there, there. Perfect. And then build wall torches. Yeah. And that's us. Uh, that way, that way. Boom. And then as soon as those are done, I can designate them and we'll have. 25 bedrooms made, which should be able to accommodate our next wave of nomads, which would be great. Why is people still going out? Oh, I can shut up. God, man. Good God, man. Hopefully these bandages are actually get to stock again. It is now spring, and we're getting a slight stock of bandages back. That's great, because that means that stuff will start growing again, which is mainly our cotton. I like how these are just named horribly. Strob, cotton, wheat. Apple grove, yak pasture, birch grove, pine grove. Yeah, no, wheat, strob, cotton. Obviously I wasn't feeling it that day, Jesus Christ. Hopefully we don't get attacked tonight, I don't think we will. I've not heard anything yet, so fingers crossed. And uh, that means we'll be able to get our nice big wave of nomads. It's a bit of a longer episode because obviously I says I was waiting until these got made and then the guy went to bed. Which isn't fantastic. Whatever he is. No name, no, number one. No. 
Ignoring him, gnome number one. <laughs> Excuse me? Whoa, 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 whoa. The funness is priority 19. Alright. Alright. The forge is priority 5. Alright. So riddle me this, Batman. The fuck? Blacksmith does all the metals. So why you not the forge? Huh? Look, there's definitely copper bars kicking about. Like, so why is that what you're doing? Can I suspend this right now? Does he need coal? No, there's coal there. What are you doing now? Um, I don't... I don't even... Oh, for Christ's sakes, I'm just going to unsuspend this and let him do whatever he's doing because clearly I've got no fucking clue. Requires smelting one. Anvil, yep, yeah, smelting one. Oh shit, no, anvil, yes, smelting one. So why... Profession, blacksmith... Yeah, it was smelting, yep. Yeah. Definitely. Does he not have smelting one? Is that his issue? No, he's got smelting eight. It's not very good, but he's got it. Ah, oh, God. Whatever. Alright, guys, I'm going to have to call it an episode here because it's getting really late and that guy's just fucking around. So, as always, guys, thanks a lot for watching. If you managed to watch this far, please drop a wee like. Um, and hopefully, I'll see you next time. Bye bye, guys. Peace out.